hello there, hail and welcome everyone to Midgard Musings. My name is Jesse. And if you're not familiar with this channel, it's about Norse heathenry, Norse heathenry related subjects. I usually upload new content here on the channel every week, uh, Sunday nights, uh, which includes a discussion live on Facebook. Uh, but tonight, or today rather, that you're watching this now, it's during the daytime, at least here in the part of the United States where I am, it's not a Sunday night and it's not a discussion video. The uh, reason for that is uh, today is actually my wedding anniversary and I'm celebrating, I've been celebrating um, this, this weekend uh, with my wife. Um, so, Vanessa, you're watching this at this point. I hope you, I hope you have enjoyed um, our wedding anniversary weekend. Um, but anyways, guys, I wanted to do a quick video and just kind of give you a little bit of an update on things pertaining to the channel, pertaining to myself, and uh, pertaining to something that is going to be coming up here on the channel in, uh, as a new series sort of thing. It's going to be a short series sort of run, and uh, we're going to be getting into that towards the end of the video. Um, first of all, let me go over uh, one thing that a lot of folks who are subscribing to this channel and who watch what I do every week um, and kind of have been a part of this thing for some time. Um, if you guys have been here, you've seen uh, some of the videos. I'm going to actually link it in a card right up here. Um, one of the last big events that happened on the channel with the whole the cops getting called, the swatting thing, whatever. A um, little bit of progress um, update of our status update on that whole event. So it's been over a month now or right around a month, I guess you could say, since the whole thing happened. And uh, there was a report that was filed and everything with the police department. And uh, it's taken now just this long for me to actually get a detective um, to get back to me. Um, I've made regular calls up there, um, talked to different individuals in the police department, finally got what I reported turned over to the Cyber Crimes Division. And... Uh, on Friday, I got a call from a detective, and um, I didn't actually speak to him, but uh, left me a voicemail and kind of told me that um, there's basically nothing that they can do. However, he's like, talk to me, and you know, we will go over some things, what you can do for safety, this, that, and the other. A lot of stuff that I'm sure that once I do actually get to speak with him on the phone uh, or in person, that uh, some of these things will probably be stuff that I've already figured out or have already done. However, I am going to be spending time talking with the detective and figuring out all the specific details. Um, I have determined um, a next step, um, which I will be talking about probably in another video or another dur or during another live stream, maybe on the Facebook page. Um, so make sure that you guys have the Facebook page liked. It's all down there in the description. and. Um, when I go live on the Facebook page, I may be talking about that or I'll upload new, lo or upload new content here to kind of give you the heads up on what's going on as far as live streaming here on the channel. Um, it's not the best thing that I wanted to hear. It's definitely, you know, I don't want to hear that there's nothing that can be done, although I do understand that the nature of this sort of prank uh, or in fact an actual crime as such as it is, uh, there is not a whole lot that the police can do, but I am not done with this yet. Rest assured, I'm not going to sit back and just let things like this happen. Um, so I've got things set in, in my mind that I want to talk to the detective about. He's finally made contact with me. There should be more coming forth from me on this about this subject. So keep that in mind. Um, number two, uh, I've talked a little bit on the Facebook page about some uh, pagan events that I will be uh, vending at, uh, being a vendor at, and uh, the first one is coming up in June. Uh, it's going to be the, I think, second or, or towards the end of June. So it's either the second weekend or the third weekend in June, something like that, the 22nd or 23rd, whatever that weekend of June is, the 20-somethings of June. Um, in uh, Springfield, Tennessee, I will be a vendor uh, for a event that is hosted annually by a local kindred in the area called Raven Moon Hearth. And uh, I will be vending at their Sunabloat event. Um, I'm going to be linking some information down in the description. I want you guys to check the links down in the description out for Raven Moon Hearth and Sunabloat. Because if you are in the Middle Tennessee area, 
um, or in an area close to Middle Tennessee and willing to travel. Uh, I know some folks in Kentucky come out to this, maybe some folks in neighboring states, Georgia, Alabama, who knows, uh, willing to want to make the trip out. Um, East Tennessee, West Tennessee, all over the state, all over the region. Um, it's going to be details about that down in the description. Um, but anyway, I will be there uh, for the Raven Moon Hearth event. Um, as a vendor, I will have some wood-burned crafts, uh, rune sets. Um, I will be doing rune readings, okay? Um, and I believe that the hearth is doing some sort of a uh, raffle uh, of sorts uh, for a free rune reading from myself. Um, uh, or a room reading of myself, Some, something that they're going to be doing as a, like a prize uh, for the event. So um, that is where if you are in the area and you've never met me in person or you've never talked to me in person or you want to come out to support the hearth and see me and see everybody and get to see what this area's uh, heathen community is about, um, come on out to Soon the Bloat in June. Check the description down there for all the details on that and I will see you then. Uh, number three. The next event that I will be vending at will be the Nashville Pagan Pride Day in September. Um, not 100% sure off the top of my head what day that is. I want to say it's like the middle of September, also on a weekend. Um, details for that are down in the description. Um, I will also be there doing some uh, uh, sales of wood burning crafts. M myself, my wife, and a friend of, of ours um, are going to be working really hard over the summer to get a nice little inventory of things going on. Uh, sales of those items are going to directly help benefit uh, Midgard Musings specifically. Um, so hopefully we, we do really good on that. Um, we'll also be doing rune readings there. Probably gonna try to at least go live um, during the event to kind of show you all what it's about. Um, maybe show off some of the uh, the vendors and, and things like that, some of our friends and, and colleagues and, and whatnot that we know that are there. Um, and just kind of give you guys the, a little bit of an insight of the heathen slash pagan community here in the Middle Tennessee area. Um, so that is what I've got going on with Midgard Musings. Got Soon the Bloat coming up in June, the Nashville Pagan Pride Day in September. Um, working on this whole issue with the live streams on the channel, hopefully getting uh, some headway and some, some resolution as far as that goes. Um, and now for the uh, announcement of this series. Thank you guys so much for staying with me so far. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, turn on bell notifications, check out all the content so that way you're notif um, you know, if, if something you're interested in, turn those bell notifications on so that way you're notified whenever I upload new stuff. But the new series, um, that is going to be starting um, in the next week. Uh, so we're watching this today on Sunday the 22nd. So next Sunday the 28th will be episode one of a rune study series. I'm going to run this series for nine weeks. Uh, so there will be not or nine episodes, right? Um, there will be content uploaded uh, each Sunday. Um, and so what it's going to be is it's going to be sort of my take, my view on the Elder Fudark runes. We're going to be talking about um, the rune meanings, um, a little bit of the history behind runes in general, uh, as far as how they were used for divination or weren't used for divination, all that kind of fun stuff. Um, people have talked about the, the whole subject of the runes uh, to me and said, you know, do a video on it, this and that. And I thought, well, it's, it's just so much to try to fit into one video Let's do a series on it. And I chose the nine-week series because of the significance and sacredness of the number nine in Norse Germanic heathenry, okay, Germanic paganism. Um, as because Odin hung from the world tree Yggdrasil for nine days and nine nights. Um, uh, there are nine realms, this and that. So nine is a significant uh, and sacred number in uh, Norse heathenry, and so the series will be a nine episode long series. We're going to be talking about the runes in each episode, so I hope you guys are looking forward to that. I'm really looking forward to that, uh, to talk with you all about the runes and see what I can learn from you and what you want to share and what we can all learn together, so 
that is today's video, guys. Um, I appreciate you watching. I appreciate you understanding um, that there was not going to be a live stream uh, on the Facebook page tonight uh, just due to the things that I've got going on personally. And um, stay tuned next week because next week, uh, next Sunday, we will be doing the discussion on the runes, uh, the rune series. I don't have a name for it yet. If you guys, that's the other thing too. I haven't have I don't have a name for the for the series just yet. So if you have an idea of what the series should be called, leave it down here in the comments. I'd love to hear what your you know thoughts are um, on the name of the of the series. And if I like it, I will use it and I will credit you for it in the video. So think about it. If you want to name the series, go ahead and drop a name idea down in the comments and uh, let me see what you guys got. So anyways guys, that's been the video for today. Thank you so much for watching. Please become a subscriber if you haven't already. Uh, you'll see it pop up here in the end screen somewhere, one of these two shoulders of mine. Um, at the end of the video there'll be some related content. Please check it all out. Let me know what you guys think. I appreciate your support with Midgard Musings. I will see you hopefully in June. And then again in September. And in the meantime, hail, thank you, and I will see you all in the next video.